together every day, having adventures as we play. Up in the hills, down on the beach, always a rainbow within reach. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, yeah. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, come on. Hello. to say hello 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 let's stop to say hello it's a way to say we're glad you're here come on and say hello hello hedgehog hello fox hello pig hello monkey when friends are near we smile and say hello when friends are far we wave and say hello it's a friendly word that shows we care come on and say hello hello mr frog hello hello, hello mr. mr goose hello hello friend Hello. Hello. Hi. Nice to see you. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> this song is about colors. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Yes, we do. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Now take two. Mix two colors and you'll make something new. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Yes, we do. You can also add a little bit of black or white. Yeah! <laughs> it's so good to see you again. The rest of the gang is already here. Let's see what Pig is up to. Hi, Pig. What are you painting? Can you tell what it is? A carrot! That's right! Where did you get orange paint? I mixed it myself. Want to see how? Yes, please. Okay, first, start with some yellow. <laughs> Then get a little bit of red and mix it in. Look, it's turning orange. Yeah, you mixed yellow and red and made orange. I'm going to call my color Sunshine Orange. Nice. Mr. Goose, Mr. Goose, I made orange. Can we make that the color of the day? Hedgehog, that's a great idea. Presenting... Orange! Which fish is orange? There it is! Orange fish. Which cupcake is orange? There it is! Orange Cupcake. Which yo-yo is orange? There it is! Orange Yo-Yo. Which book is orange? There it is! Orange Book. Marvelous! Pig, Fox, I'm going to show you a new way of painting. Ooh. Um, I don't see any paint brushes. That's right, Fox. We're not going to paint with paint brushes. Huh? Huh? We're going to paint with sponges. Ready to see what happens? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Do you want to start with blue paper or red paper? Mm, 
blue, please. And I'll take red, please. Great. Now, pick up a sponge. Dip it in the yellow paint. <laughs> and start painting. Oh, 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 look. My paper is turning orange. Because red and yellow make orange. My paper is turning green. That's right. <gasps> Look how smooth it looks. I'm tapping my sponge. <laughs> it looks rough, like, like rocks. Smooth and rough are textures. Say it after me. Textures. Textures. I'm done. Me too. Let's hang up your paintings and look at them. What's something that's the same about your paintings? We both painted with sponges. That's right. What else? We both painted with yellow. Yes. And what's something different about your paintings? Mine came out green. And Pig's is orange. And my painting is rough, but Fox's is smooth. That's right. Now, what do we do when we're done painting? We go play. Uh-huh. But first... We clean up. Oh, right. That's right. Let's clean up together. Okay. okay. I'm crunching leaves. But only orange leaves. I see one. Let's look for more. Let's look for one more. Do you see it? There it is. We did it. <laughs> Yay! See you! It's story time! Yay! Gather round, everyone! What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called, I Love My Mom. It's about a little girl who learns a lot from her mom. Let's see what she learns. Let's begin. I Love My Mom. Written by Fung Sime Famakse. Illustrated by Nibong Sing Sakaun. My mom's name is Lee. She works hard all the time, and I learn so much from her. When my mom cooks, I learn to cook too. When she waters the flowers, I learn to water the flowers too. My mom bought me a bicycle, and she taught me how to ride it. As I ride my bicycle, my mom smiles when I go, Whee! At night, my mom makes the bed. I learn how to make the bed, too. Before bedtime, my mom tells me stories. When I'm sleepy, my mom sings me a lullaby. I love my mom so much. The end. Thank you, Mr. Goose. Thank you for reading with me. Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids. Hello, Mr. Frog. Let's sing a song called She'll Be Coming Round the Mountain. I'll sing the first verse, then you sing along with me. She'll be coming round the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming round the mountain when she comes. 
She'll be coming round the mountain. She'll be coming round the mountain. She'll be coming round the mountain when she comes. Now you'll all sing along with me. She'll be driving six white horses. She'll be driving six white horses when she comes. She'll be driving six white horses when she comes. She'll be driving six white horses. She'll be driving six white horses. She'll be driving six white horses when she comes. We'll all go out to meet her when she comes. Oh, we'll all go out to meet her when she comes. Oh, we'll all go out to meet her when she comes. Oh, we'll all go out to meet her. We'll all go out to meet her. We'll all go out to meet her when she comes. Well done. Thank you, Mr. Frog. Thank you. Goodbye. Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. Alligator. Ah, ah, alligator. <laughs> Arrow. Arrow begins with A. Arrow. Ant. Ah, ah, ant. Apple. Ah, ah, apple. Astronaut. Ah, ah, astronaut. What letter do all these words start with? A. That's right. The letter A. Monkey. Monkey. Hmm. Where is he? <laughs> oh, what was that? <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> Look! <laughs> Where do you think Monkey is? It's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Let's stop to say goodbye before we say hello again. We need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. goodbye. <laughs> Time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them leave them alone and they'll come home bringing their tails behind them little bo peep has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them leave them alone and they'll come home bringing their tails behind them Bo Peep 
deep has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them leave them alone and they'll come home bringing their tails behind them